yeah, it's, it's definitely in the um, in the top range of, for example, Sudbury. It would be comparable to some of the better mineralization at Voices Bay. It's not as high a tenor as some of the Thompson ores, but that's uh, that's not a problem. It's uh, it's definitely going to make a very interesting material from the point of view of uh, process technology. If uh, it turns out that all the nickel is contained in the pentlandite, all the better. Um, it's still possible some of that tenor may be because there is nickel in the pyrotite. And you've always got to keep, keep that in mind and uh, down the road there'll be geometallurgy um, investigations undertaken to try and work out the deportment of nickel in the system. Because the nickel tenor of the sulphide is so high, so the order of let's say around 5% nickel, um, if you think about 5% nickel tenor, that means 5% nickel in massive sulphide which is a very, very high grade. I'd be quite happy with half of that. That would be um, really... <laughs> so 50% 50% sulfide in a rock would make a very, very healthy, uh, healthy style of mineralization. Mm -hmm.